it's rare that players see a silver lining in successive losses, but such is the case for Ginebra's top point guard Latunorio and resident import Justin Brownlee. Moments after Ginebra's painful 104-97 overtime loss to San Miguel Beer Sunday at the Moa Arena, both Tenorio and Brownlee sounded upbeat about their team's chances despite losing for the fifth time in six games in the PBA Commissioner's Cup. Before bowing to the Beerman, Ginebra suffered a 93-82 defeat to Moralco Friday night also at the Moa Arena which served as Brownlee's conference debut. Tonight was definitely a tough loss, but tonight I think there were lots of improvement from Friday's game," said Brownlee. Tough loss but we can build on further. Of course, nobody wants to be 1 and 5 but we're still confident. Tenorio, meantime, admits offense is still an issue for them. But he feels that there is a reason for them to feel good about their performance on the other end of the court. Medio OK young defensive Naman, we went back to basic this weekend, so I think May Maganda came in Nakakita defensively, said Tunario offensively Medio scattered Pa Kami Kasi Friday was the first game of Justin, and this is his second game. Dalawang big games Pa. It may be tough, though, to believe Tenorio's assertion. The Beerman had five players scoring in double figures. Rinaldo Bachman, 27 points, 11 rebounds, June Marfa Hardo, 24 points and 19 rebounds, Arwin Santos, 19 points, 8 rebounds, Marcio Lassiter, 11 points, 8 rebs, and Chris Ross, 10 points, contributed substantial numbers for the Beerman's cause. But Tenorio is not one to dwell on the past as he seems all set to face the task ahead and take it one game at a time in their final five games of the elimination round. Every game is do or die for us, and hopefully young never say die spirit Lumab is starting next game, he said. There's room for improvement for us, but the margin for error now is really minimal. Dot up next for Ginebra is an LEX in an out of town game this Saturday, Magnolia on June 17, Colombian Dip on June 20, the Alaska Aces on June 24, and Global Port on July 6 to complete their elimination round assignments.